Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I want to show you guys some things that I bought from Zara. I have been shopping there a lot, um, especially in the year 2020 and not really because of the pandemic and all that stuff. But the reason I will shop, I've been shopping at Zara a lot is just because I did a whole changeover with my wardrobe and I actually got rid of probably three large trash bags, black trash bags of clothes that I just donated just because I want to change my wardrobe up. I wanted my wardrobe to be full of neutral clothing that I could change and interchange with different um, items. So that's the reason why I've been shopping at Zara. So recently I shopped at Zara and they came in and I wanted to show them to you guys. The first thing that I got was this sweater and I'm gonna insert clips so that way you guys can see what it looks like. But I got this sweater and it's like a crop sweater. This was $39.90 and I got it in a size medium. And I got it in a size medium because on the model it looked like it wasn't, not that it was fitting, but it was like slightly loose and I'm pretty sure the model wore a size small. So I got a size medium for that reason because yes, could I wear a size small? Yeah, absolutely. But I didn't want, I wanted more like a loose, something that was more loose fitting and something that, you know, I could wear with my high-waisted trousers or my high-waisted jeans and it's just, it wouldn't be tight. I wanted loose. I like to wear my clothes a lot more looser. How many times can I say loose? So yeah, so this, and what I, what I liked about it was that it was more like a neutral cream color, which is so up my alley. I don't really like color, but when I do go for color, it's usually neutral. Um, so I really like this one, and it seemed pretty warm. It's not wool or anything like that, but it just feels like it's gonna be like really warm. So that's the reason why I got it. So the next item that I got is another sweater. So basically it's like all sweaters in one pants. So the next item that I got was this sweater it's super baggy it's like a beautiful bluish gray charcoal color um it's very cool tone it's not warm tone at all which is different for me because i usually like warm tone or warm, warm undertone clothing but i like this one a lot and what i like too was that it just looked very loose uh, i got this in a size small and it was $49.90 and I really loved it now when I did this Sara haul I also bought a whole bunch of stuff for my kids so if you want to see some things that I got for my kids I have two dollars like I said so if you want to see some things that I said you can head over to my Instagram um, so that way you can look at some of the things that I bought for my kids because they're so cute but anyway I got this in a size small but it is loose fitting so if you don't like something that's loose fitting um, but you're about my size, I would get a size extra small. For reference, I'm 5'5 and 145 pounds um, on most days. So the next item that I got was this sweater, which is the same thing as the gray sweater, but in different color. Same price, $49.90, and I got it in a size small. So I got, so I got this because I have been searching high and low for a sweater, a navy sweater, just navy something. But everything that I saw for navy was super like colorful or had like little designs on it with a hint of navy or just not navy enough or wasn't casual enough or conservative enough. I just wanted something like just casual and I, I couldn't find that anywhere. And so when I saw this in this beautiful navy color, I was like hopping on it. So yes, I love this sweater. It felt super, like super, super casual, super warm, and it's loose. All right, so the next item that I got was this sweater, and same thing, it's very loose fitting. So I got this in a size small, and it was $49.90, and the reason I got it in a size small was because same thing, it, the model looked like she was wearing a size small or extra small and even then it looked big on her so I was like okay let me get this in a size small so I'm happy I did 
And I really love this because I feel like items like this with patterns like this and the material, it just makes the item look more expensive than it was. I feel like $49.90, to me, it, it's not expensive, but it is pricey. But I just feel like it just makes it look just a little bit more expensive, especially with like the simple details. And so that's another reason why for me, I like simple details, um, neutral clothing, just because for me, it's easy to match together with other items of clothing, but also I feel like the the less amount of colors or or vibrancy or whatever in your wardrobe i think it just makes you look more expensive so you could get an item of clothing for 30 dollars 40 dollars and you just add like some jewelry some earrings maybe like a watch or something and you automatically just look like you've leveled up by like 10 pounds about 10 pounds you love it up by 10 you know 10 levels or something so that's the reason so why. the next item i got so you guys remember the first sweater that i got that was cropped and it was like a deeper tan so this is the same thing but in a lighter tan it and this was 39.90 um and now same thing as the other darker tan one this is a size medium and for the same reason when i'm wearing my high-waisted pants this is a bit loose and even though I love dark colors, I wanted something lighter just because I feel like that is something that, ugh, that is something that's missing from my wardrobe. It's just a little bit more, not wanna say brightness, but more lightness. You know, like colors like this, like I usually don't gravitate towards it. I'm usually wearing black. And if you looked at my past videos, I'm usually wearing black because I love black. I like, I like to wear black. I'm not, I don't like to wear color. However, um, I think clothes like this is very beautiful, very neutral. And so the last item of clothing that I got from my Zara haul are these trousers. So I'm just holding it up, but you're gonna see in the clip what it actually looks like. So it is super long. So it is super long. This was $49.90 and I got this in size small. So so like I said, even so I like I said, I am a size um, usually four in pants, um, and yes, I'm 147 pounds, but my hip, butt, and thigh ratio is a lot, is not a lot, but it's bigger than my waist ratio. So yes, on my waist, I'm a size four, but on my thighs and butt, I could be a six or eight, but that means that'll make the pants a lot looser. So with these pants, like at first, I wasn't going to keep them. I wasn't going to keep them because they didn't have pockets. I like putting my hands in my pockets and I don't like when things don't have pockets. So I wasn't gonna keep it, but then I put it on and it just made my butt look great. Like my butt look amazing in them. So I decided to keep them and you know, I could definitely see me like, I, so I wanted something in this color first of all, because I wanted something that I could wear with sneakers, like my Converse, um, my like my low top uh, chucks. I can wear sandals with it. I can even wear heels with it if I wanted to. But for the most part, I really wanted something like this because I was missing something like this in my wardrobe. Um, something high waisted, tan, long. I really like my trousers either um, baggy with like the ends, like the bottom kind of straight cut or really like wide leg, loose and long. And this kind of checks all those boxes for me. And I like that it has belt loops. I'm not gonna get a pant or trouser that does not have belt loops because, especially because of my hip thigh butt ratio compared to my waist, it's not gonna fit me right if I don't so say if I have to like up a size in pants so that way the pants can fit correctly, I want to be able to put a belt on it. And so that's the reason why I got this. And I love it. Um, I, might get a, I might get another one similar to this so that way I have one that does have pockets and one that doesn't. So that is it for my Zara haul. I told you guys it was gonna be a short haul, but I really hope you guys enjoyed it. And I really need to go to sleep because it's late right now. Well, it's not late, it's like seven right now, but 
I have yawned in this video like five times, so it's time for me to go to sleep. But I hope you guys enjoy the video. If you guys wanna see more things about me or know more about me, I do post a lot on my Instagram. I post a little bit on my Twitter and I do have a TikTok. So if you want to follow me on TikTok, you better follow me on TikTok because I feel like I'm pretty funny, but maybe I'm not. But I feel like I'm pretty entertaining, so check me out on TikTok. I'll provide all the links, snapshots here. And you guys have a good day.